Now a 10, another United flight incident involving SFO. This time after inspectors say something was missing from the plane when it landed in Oregon. What recently released body cam videos revealing about a shootout between Sonoma County deputies and a suspect? And when are we going to see the Capitol Pier reopen to visitors after more than a year in repairs following a historic storm that took a bite out of the pier? Now in prime time, from the Bay Area's local news station, you're watching Cron 4 News at 10. And thanks so much for joining us on Cron 4 News at 10. I'm Vicki Liviakis. I'm Ken Wayne. More trouble tonight for United Airlines after another plane leaving SFO has a problem. Yeah, this time an external panel is discovered missing from that plane after it landed. A United says it was not an emergency landing when the plane touched down in Oregon this afternoon. But the post-flight inspection revealed something was missing from the plane. Ground Force Dan Thorne, Live Force at SFO with the story. Dan. Yeah, Ken, this is now just the uh, latest issue that S that the um, United Airlines have been dealing with uh, when their planes are leaving or coming to SFO. These mechanical issues have been really concerning for a lot of United passengers, and United says they do not know when this external panel came off of the plane today. Another issue for a United Airlines flight leaving SFO. After landing at Rogue Valley International Medford Airport Friday afternoon, a United aircraft was found without an external panel. A Medford Airport spokesperson says they were forced to briefly pause operations on the runway to look for any debris. None was found. This is a, a very minor incident in the grand scheme of things. Retired commercial airline pilot Doug Rice says the external panel is an aluminum fairing, which helps smooth the air against the plane, making for a smoother ride. This specific Boeing 737 is a 25-year-old aircraft, and Rice says at that age, metal fatigue can set in. These aircraft go through a significant amount of maintenance, and they should be catching these things. What we're learning now is that we have to be more aware of these things as they go through maintenance and double checking and triple checking them. This latest issue for United is making some passengers feel uneasy. On Thursday, a flight approaching SFO had a hydraulic leak with some smoke seen by the landing gear. Last week, a Japan-bound plane lost a wheel during takeoff and had to make an emergency landing in Los Angeles. And on Monday, a United flight bound for SFO from Australia was forced to turn around because of a maintenance issue. I think it's a little bit uh, scary, the fact that this keeps coming up all of a sudden. And I'm, I don't know if it's because we haven't been aware and now we are, or if all of a sudden it's, it's an immediate issue that we're dealing with. It's scary for people. A United spokesperson says there wasn't an emergency landing in Oregon because there was no indication of damage during the flight. They're now going to do an investigation to find out what happened. Well, the FAA says that they are also going to be looking into this incident as well. United says that there were no injuries that were reported among the more than 130 passengers and crew on board. At SFO, Dan Thorne, Cron 4 News. Dan, thank you.